protesters yell their opposition from the gallery. Tennessee lawmakers pass a bill allowing teachers to carry concealed handguns. Catherine Vaughn, an elementary art teacher and Tipton County Education Association president, watched as the votes were being counted. Yesterday was an incredibly difficult day to be a Tennessee educator. I sat alone in my classroom and watched in horror the live feed from our legislative session as our representatives voted to give teachers guns. Lawmakers have debated gun law since last year's deadly shooting at Nashville's Covenant School. More guns in schools just means more dead children. And gun deaths are already a leading cause of deaths for children in our state. It's incredibly dangerous to have students in proximity to weapons. Republicans have often pushed for teachers to be armed in response to the numerous school shootings. I really believe that this bill could save lives and also prevent uh, threats of mass violence or or any kind of active shooter situation in our schools. The bill would allow one school employee per every 75 students to carry a gun at the school. A principal, school district, and law enforcement agency would have to agree to let staff carry guns. They would then have to go through 40 hours of school security training and a mental evaluation. But is that enough? I couldn't imagine if I was an educator still in the, in the classroom and a child attacked me. If I had on a weapon, what would have been my first reaction to do to defend myself? And so I'm worried that when situations happen, people won't have time to de-escalate to think about the best thing to do in conflict resolution. Reverend Althea Green, the chairwoman of the MSCS Board of Education, opposes the bill. We ask educators here at Memphis Shelby County Schools to do so much. And I believe the best use of their time, Alex, would be focusing on those topics that are that they are licensed to teach. And WREG also reached out to MSCS's new superintendent, Dr. Marie Fagans, in an email. She says, quote, since arriving in Memphis, I have met with hundreds of educators who have asked for more books, improved technology and better pay. No one has asked to bring a weapon to improve the learning environment, end quote. By the way, you can read the full statement when you click this story on WREG.com.